I'm Kathy Casey and welcome to the Liquid Kitchen. I'm going to be making a gin and bitter lemon drink today. First I'm going to start with the bitter lemon mixture. I have four lemons. I'm going to cut the ends off and then cut each one in half and then cut each half into four. I'm going to add those to my Vitamix blender cup. Here we go. And leaving the peels on, add our little bit of bitterness. All right, this is my second lemon. It smells so good. Okay, this is the last one. Really fresh smelling. And I love a little bit of bitterness in my drinks. So I'm going to get rid of these little lemon, the lemon butts here. All right, I'm going to add two cups of water and a cup and a half of sugar. This is going to be delicious. All right, here we go. Over to my Vitamix. Bar Boss Advance. I'm going to pulse this until it's almost smooth, but a few bits still remain. It's really going to depend upon the size of your lemons, how long you're going to have to pulse for. But this looks really good. All right, I'm going to remove the top. And then I'm going to go into a pan. You can see that there's still some kind of chunky pieces in there, but not too big. All right, I'm going to turn my burner on. I'm going to let this come up to a boil, and then I'm going to let it boil for about a minute. So it's come to a really nice boil here now. I'm going to turn it off and then let it sit for an hour to steep. So once it's sat an hour, I'm going to put it through a fine mesh strainer. And the delicious results are this. Next we're going to make the cocktail. I'm going to measure in an ounce and a half of Martin Miller's gin, which is one of my favorite gins. And like I said, if you love gin and tonic, this is a really great alternative. Now we're going to do an ounce of our bitter lemon mixture. It's really nicely strained, so it's real clear and beautiful. I'm going to ice this up. Now if you want to do something a little tiny bit different, you can add a piece of fresh tarragon, which I'm going to do. And that flavor is really, really great in here. I'm going to cap it and shake it. All right, and then we're going to pour it to a tall glass, and I'm going to add some Perrier sparkling water to lengthen and lighten the drink. Give it a quick stir, very refreshing. I'm going to garnish it with a fresh lemon and a cherry. And because I used fresh tarragon, I'm going to put a little piece of fresh tarragon for the garnish too. And that's the gin with house-made bitter lemon.